Take a look at this mess right here. Late this afternoon, home builder Ivory Homes sent an update after the sinkhole on Orchard Ridge Lane earlier this week. Oh, wow. Ivory Homes says two families are displaced and 11 homes mostly under construction impacted. They also say that they're reinforcing the severely damaged road and trying to stop erosion. Now, this is a story we first showed you as it was happening earlier this week. Amanda Gilbert is live in that neighborhood right now. So, Amanda, this is going to be a really, really big fix. It is. Kaysville says there's four homes who will be without water likely for months. Now you can see there's not much water behind me, but you see this channel. The city is going to try to redirect this water in order to focus on rebuilding all that erosion and to prevent any more damage. It's going to take a big fix. So for now, they are monitoring this area 24-7. They're very concerned. I mean, they never expected this. Neighborhood coordinator Gary Jones says it's been a difficult week for people who live here. It's pretty amazing to see what water can do. Poor souls that lived in that house, they were they received the keys and uh, on Tuesday and this happened Tuesday night. Two News reporter Brian Malay, he was on scene as the damage was happening. You have buyer's remorse today? <laughs> no, not necessarily. We really love it here. We're grateful. We're where we're at and we're just hopeful this is a one-time thing. Public Works Director Josh Belknap says the erosion destroyed the storm drain here. What's the fix? This is going to have to be totally rebuilt. Uh, the underground utilities that have been exposed or destroyed. But first... Right now, our, our main focus is looking at ways that we can get the water out of the roadway. Uh, and, and, and find other places that we can temporarily send it. This is to make sure there's no more damage. What happens if the water breaches the sandbags? So uh, that, that would continue to cause further damage. That's why the city and homeowners are keeping a close eye on things. And... Seeing all these people come out, it's really heartwarming. Uh, kind of hits a nerve. Neighbors will keep helping each other out all weekend. And for more information on what caused this sinkhole and why it happened right here, it has to do with the new homes under construction. You can head to our news app or website. In Kaysville, Amanda Gilbert, KOTV 2 News.